Hello, welcome back to my channel. In today's video I will be checking out this game called Bloxco V3. It is a realistic grocery store where you can RP and have fun. To get started, go over to the side of the building where you will find a ATM which you can get money from to buy items from the store. You start off with $100. To get your money insert your card into the machine and select cash. Then select the amount you want and it will give it to you. After you have gotten your cash make your way to the front of the store. When you are there you have two options you could either go to the staff room, which I will explain later, or shopping. For now chose shopping. Go through the doors and through the gates to access the store. Now that you are in the store there is many items to choose from and buy, there is fruits, drinks, meats, dairy, frozen food and many more. Those items can be found near the wall but there is more items in the aisles. There is a bunch of items and anything you want can be found in this store. I will now show you how to check out items in the store. First take a item from the store such as a battery and soup, but you can choose any item and as many as you want of it. After you have your items make your way to the front of the store near where the registers are. You can either go to the tills or the self-checkout area. I recommend to go to self-checkout as the tills don't work that well as this is a new game. When you find an open checkout machine scan your items you picked up from the store. Click the method of payment when it prompts you then insert cash or credit, which depends on what you chose, enter a random pin into the card reader that is to the right of the main machine, then take your receipt. After that you can leave the store with your goods but I will stay and show you other things in this store. There is also this scanner that you can use to speed up your shopping. Just go up to the main scanner and scan your Bloxco members card which you can get by joining the Bloxco group. To use this go up to any item and click it as if you were to grab it normally. It will then automatically go into your cart. This helps speed up shopping and checking out. There is other things in this store such as a bakery that is being worked on and functioning bathrooms. I'm not sure who would use it but it's there, there is also a coffee shop that is being worked on as well. This section of the video will be focused on the staff part of the game. You can apply to work here by going through their application process through their game and discord server. There is two things near the entrance one of them is that blue screen which I'm not sure what it does. The other screen on the wall is the EAS system. This system goes off when someone steals and walks out the store without paying. It will alert you when it happened and who did it. Now going into this door there is a bunch of office rooms which don't do much. At the end of the room there's the door leading to the staff uniform room. In this room you get your uniform and a headset which is used to communicate to other staff members who have it on. I will now show you the storage room which you can enter by going through the bakery and through the door. In the loading bay packages would spawn and they would contain the items need to restock the shelves. The items that need restocking will be marked in blue. You can do more things with cleaning the store such as cleaning up spills that appear as you play. There is other important staff roles that you can get such as the security job. You can use handcuffs to arrest people who are stealing. You can get this job and others by going through training sessions. That is all for today's video. If you wish to see more of this game or other games let me know in the comments, goodbye, 